everyone, it's your girl Weeza and welcome or welcome back to my world. In today's video we have another Adore Me swimsuit haul and I really liked some of the pieces from my last haul that it really encouraged me to want to get more so that is exactly what we're going to do today. I got three one pieces and I got three bikini styles. This time I picked more XL styles and not so much the plus size because I found that the plus size just didn't fit me right. So in this video, I definitely have more skimpier bikini two-piece options. That was definitely feedback that you guys wanted to see. You wanted to see more like two-piece bikini styles. So I was totally on board with you guys. So I got a lot of fun options in those. And I also ventured away from black. I don't have anything that's black in this haul and that's that's saying a lot, but I got a lot of fun patterns and colors, things that I generally wouldn't go to, so it should be really, really fun. Before I get started, I just wanted to mention that Adore Me is sponsoring today's video, and they have gifted me all of these swimsuits that I have tried on today. They have also gifted you a welcome gift. You can get your first swimwear for $24. I will leave that coupon code and the affiliate link down in the description bar below, so if you're interested in getting yourself a cute little swimsuit for summer, go ahead and check that out. With that being said, if you're interested in seeing all of the goodies, all of the swimsuits, that I got from Adore Me part two, then keep watching. Today we're gonna start with the bikinis because they are my favorite. I am so excited that I got these. I am in love with every single one. If you liked anything from this haul, I will put all of the names of the swimsuits and the sizes that I got down in the description bar below. So if you're a similar size to me and you wanna grab it, it will be down in the description bar below for you. Starting off with this little cute number. This is the Steph Contour. It is a bandeau style top with a cute little bow in it in this beautiful kind of like picnic checker cloth fabric. I love this kind of fabric. I just think it's so cute. There is a name for it, but I can't think of it off the top of my head. And then they have these thicker straps they're kind of like just flatter the arms and make it look so cute. And in the back, you have a nice sturdy thick hook with lots of options. Like there's about three or four options there to really adjust it to your fit. The bottoms are a bikini style with a little bit of a ruffle trim and then they tie up on the sides. I think the ruffle detail just gives it a little bit of something extra extra, gives it a little bit of cuteness and the bottoms are pretty full coverage. They definitely are a little bit more on the cheekier side, but the ruffle kind of just gives it a little bit more of a cuter moment. So it doesn't look as scandalous. I got the Steph Contour in a size XL. So this is a part of their conventional or their standard sizes. I felt like it fit better. The top fit me perfectly. The bottoms were a smidge tight, but because they have this little tie detail, I can really like loosen them up a little bit and just fit them to me. If you watch my last video, that's generally my problem area. I'm really tiny up top and I have bigger hips and a bigger bum. So the plus size fits me perfectly on the bottom, but the top part is just, it's not right for me because I'm just so small up top. I think this one would look stunning with a pair of white jeans with some like colorful sunnies and like kind of mix it up a little bit. Some gold hoops, gold jewelry. One of my favorites from this haul. Next we have Miss Tiffany. Miss Tiffany contour is more of like a triangle, kind of more like traditional bikini style, but they have this cute little ruffle detail on the neckline. So on the inner neckline, you have ruffles. And then on the bottom of the bikini, they have ruffles all around it as well. This is so cute, so fun, so flirty. I really like this flower pattern as well. These are definitely the colors that I gravitate towards if I'm gonna go for color. So that's why I think I was drawn to it. And the bottoms come in the same pattern and they have a little triangle V in the front, it really contours your body. Hopefully you can see that just like right here. It has a little bit of a contour detail. Then on the back, we have this cute little ruffle continuing on from the front part of the leg all the way to the front. And then this guy has a scrunch bum. The scrunch bum makes it look so beautiful on your bum. I'm loving it. The little ruffle detail makes it again, a little bit more cute and not so scandalous. So it doesn't look as cheeky as it may look on other people, if that makes any sense. This one is in a size XL again. So again, going with the more standard, more conventional sizes, not the plus size in this one. And it just seemed to fit me better. The top was amazing. I love the cup fit, but also this one was super adjustable because you can untie the front and then tighten it or loosen it as tight as you want. So very adjustable and very customizable. And the thing I was most worried about was the bottoms, but the bottoms actually fit me very well. The ruffle was not as ruffly as it may have been on like the plus size bottom, if that makes any sense, because it was stretched 
little bit too taut, but I did make it work by making the bottoms a little bit more cheeky by pulling them up my bum a little bit. And that gave a little bit like looseness to the fabric. It made the ruffle a little bit more ruffly. I think this one would look so cute with some light denim or even white denim with some obviously gold hoops, big sunglasses, my kind of thing. Perfect for a good beach day, lake day, something like that. But I saw the print, I saw the ruffles and I just needed to have her. And the last two piece is the Tatiana contour. Now this one is really complicated and it's gonna be hard for me to show you. So it might be best just to show you on. But the top is again, kind of like conventional triangle bikini. It has these really, really pretty circular knots on the top and then it goes into more of a halter style. The top is crisscrossy. So you can see on the chest area, it crisscrosses in the front and has like little peak holes there. Then the back, the back is my favorite part. It crisscrosses, it ties up, and it just looks so nice and so flattering. Again, this is one that you can adjust if you are having like a big boob day or a small boob day. Like you can really just tighten it and loosen it as you please. That's why I really like more adjustable bikini styles because they give you that versatility. This is one that you would wear like the days that you're gonna do like things or activities on the beach. You're gonna go play volleyball, you're gonna go swimming, like actively swimming. This one is actually pretty secure and will lock you in and you didn't feel like you were gonna spill out. So I can always appreciate that. Bottoms are pretty full coverage as well. They have a really nice tie detail on the side, which actually tie in perfectly with the top of the triangle pieces right here with that circular detail. I think that's where they were going with that. But I like the aspect of it being super adjustable. That is definitely what I need again to be able to adjust it as I need fit. Some days I like it looser, some days you need tighter. You lose five pounds, you gain five pounds. These types of bikinis definitely give you that versatility to be able to adjust accordingly. Tatiana is in a size XL and is in part of the regular or conventional sizes. Again, not plus size. I see myself wearing these with gold jewelry, of course, and like maybe some dark denim or even just putting like a nice cover up on top. This one is kind of a statement piece, kind of does all the work for you. So you don't need to dress it up too, too much. A little bit of gold jewelry, some sunnies and just like a cover up. And I think you'd be good to go with this one. Next, let's get on to the one pieces. And I have three more one pieces to try on for you. And I kind of have like a greenish theme going on. Totally didn't mean to do that. It was just the ones that stood out to me the most. My first one piece and probably my favorite is the Morgan Contour Plus. It is this beautiful one piece that has these like cute little ties on it. It even has these like bow in the back. It is so cute. I would literally wear this one as a shirt. I think it is just so cute. And I actually really like this green color. It is very flattering on me as we'll see in my try on. This one here has a more triangle bikini top with a cute bow in the middle. Then just below that in the waist area is another tie with a bow tie. It really cinches your waist and it gives you that hourglass figure. Then on the back, we have this cute bow. It cuts down very flattering and then in the back it has a little bit of a scrunch butt and it really just kind of contours your butt and gives you a full coverage moment without being too cheeky. These straps are also super thick because this is a plus. So I went with the zero X in this and I found the top was a little bit too big again, but the bottoms fit me perfect. It was key for me to have this bow in the back to really tie it tight and cinch me in so the top wouldn't move around on me, but I did have the slightest bit of gaping in the front where my chest area is because it was too big on me. But I see myself wearing this as a top with of course a gold jewelry, maybe some high-waisted jeans and just like rocking it. I'm definitely gonna be getting a lot of use out of this. It's just so versatile. You can wear it with so many things and this green is gorgeous, love. Continuing on with the plus size one pieces, I have one more for you and this is the Elena Contour. If you recall from my previous haul, I tried on a bikini that was black and it crisscrossed in the front and I was obsessed with it. It was my favorite one and I just needed more of my life. So I saw that they had a one piece version of it. So this one crisscrosses in the front here and gives you a very flattering neckline, makes your shoulders look really nice, makes your collarbone look really nice. So I wanted to see what the one piece was all about. So it comes in this really cute cheetah print color. Then on the one side, we actually have cutouts and the cutouts are really cute. A nice little addition to the piece. The back was definitely more full coverage. As with all of the plus size one pieces that I've tried, the backs are generally a lot more full coverage. So just keep that in mind if you're buying the plus size version of things. I see myself not even wearing this as a swimsuit. This is 100% gonna be a shirt, wear it with a pair of black jeans. That is how I see myself wearing it. Black jeans, gold jewelry, not a necklace, just like really big hoops and I'll be good to go. And my last one is Monroe. This is the Monroe contour. This is part of the regular or conventional sizes. This is not plus size, which 
I was honestly surprised because it was the biggest on me and I thought it was plus size when I put it on, but the cups and the top part of the suit were massive for me. So it was just really, really weird. My favorite part is the neckline. I love how it plunges down and I am obsessed with the back. Like look how stunning the back is. It crisscrosses, it bunches, it gives you a very nice contoured back, which I really, really love. It has this really nice sash in the front as well, which you can wear straight down or you can bunch it up and really accentuate your waist. Nonetheless, I wanted to go for a little bit of a tropical moment with this one. And I do really like the pattern, but I just don't think it looks good on me. This is gonna go down as my least favorite one of the bunch, but it is really cute. For styling options of this guy, I honestly think just some gold jewelry and you're good to go cover up with this one. Again, the print is quite loud, so you don't need to do too, too much with this. So just kind of rock it and wear it and just be you in it. That is everything that I got this time round. What was your favorite? For me, I'm digging the two pieces this time round. I think the two pieces won. Let me know which one was your favorite, who won this round, the one pieces or the two pieces. Don't forget to go and check out my previous Adore Me haul. If you haven't seen that bathing suit video already, I will link it down in the description bar below so you can go ahead and check it out. As well, if you're interested in grabbing your own swimsuit, there is a welcome offer for $24 for your first piece or your swimsuit down in the description bar below. So make sure you go ahead and check it out and shop that link. With that being said, I don't have anything else to say. So thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for hanging out with me. I'll catch you on my next one. See ya.